Hello everyone. Uh, today we'll see how to create a snapshot volume in LVM. So I've created a, a VG uh, that is a snap VG here, and then uh, I've created a volume under it. Uh, this is snap wall. Uh, then <coughs> what uh, I have uh, formatted it, and uh, it is mounted under this uh, file system uh, that is uh, snapfs and it has some data in it as well. You can see, uh, you can see it here. It has some data uh, here. So and now it is time to uh, do the uh, <clears throat> do the snapshot creation on this. Before this, I would like to show you something uh, like the LV display, and then uh, you know uh, the LV we have created uh, the LV we have created. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh, let me just. Uh, this is our LV dev map or uh, snap PG. So uh, I'll just show you this. This is the LV. You can uh, see the VG name and the map, uh, the LV name. And then we'll create a, uh, a snapshot volume of this PG and mount there and see if the data, whatever we have there in the uh, that in the snap wall, uh, we should have that in the snapshot volume create now. So let's do that. Okay, uh, now create uh, uh, the snapshot volume. I'll be create hyphen s will create a snapshot volume as we have created uh, uh, the uh, we have created the original uh, volume with 400 extents. So we'll create the snapshot volume of exact size and then hyphen s will create a snapshot volume and the source volume will be uh, this one the snap volume and i have given the new volume name is snap wall 2 uh, let's do that create that okay now you can see uh, we have uh, the snap wall 2 uh, has been created and we'll do we'll see that uh, what is our snap wall uh, 2 let us you see here okay uh let me show you here you can see uh and this is a snap wall 2 under snap v and it is, has been created on this server uh, on this time the timestamp here and you can see the lv snap thought status here active destination for snap uh ball so uh, this is uh, uh the uh, you know uh, this is uh, uh lv snapshot status so this is our volume name original source volume name so uh it is been uh, the snapshot has been taken from that uh, volume so now the point is we'll see how to uh, like if it has the same data or not okay now so to do that we'll mount it uh let's mount this one mount have nt ext4 and then uh what is our uh, dev mapper then uh should be our bg name is that now b now what uh let's mount it once class 70 so we mount it we can see the steps now you can see <coughs> you can see uh that it has the same size as of the snap fs the empty has the same size and we can see uh the data inside uh, the mnt mnt mount point uh, go here you will see the same data here the, the basically the content of it uh, directory so uh, you can see uh it has the same data of uh, uh same data as as of uh, uh snap fs uh, mount point I hope this is clear to you. In next video, uh, I'll show you how to restore the data from a snap wall, uh, uh, like snapshot volume, uh, so that uh, in 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 case uh, if there is any issue with the uh, original volume, uh, then we can restore uh, the data uh, from the snapshot volume uh, to the uh, like uh, to the original volume. So uh, we can see that. Uh, uh, in the next video.
please uh, stay tuned and uh, do subscribe my channel for more videos thank you